And with a minute to go, it's 115-98. Oh, wait a minute. Ooh. Ooh, punch is thrown there. That's what I thought I saw out of the corner of my eye. Mitchell, Zach Collins getting into it. Well, it's been a frustrating night all the way around. Collins, a bit of an elbow, and then Mitchell goes right at him. The review is for an altercation that does not immediately dissolve. And this will take a while to sort out with 54 seconds to go in 115.98. News coming up here on Ken's Five, so stay with us following the Spurs Cavaliers telecast. The previous altercation is now under video review. Video review here. Collins with a little bit of an elbow, and then Mitchell, it's a punch, it's like he pushed out yeah. both hands. Let's, let's take another look. Well, it was the first shot. They call it an NBA punch. Yeah. <laughs> Not a haymaker. A little bit more physical than World Cup. <laughs> Earlier, Collins. Oh, yeah. And Zach never actually um, complained to the officials about that one. Thought that Donovan Mitchell led with his elbow. Retribution. They've looked at the video. Now the discussion between the three officials, Nate Green, Dietrich Taylor, and Josh Tibbet. And Josh is going to tell us what they're going to do. Wow. Upon review, the play starts with an illegal screen, but an elbow to the face of Mitchell by Zach Collins. So lots of flagrant foul penalty, too. Mitchell retaliates and escalates the situation and is giving, being given a technical foul and being ejected from the game. So San Antonio will shoot one free throw for the technical foul. And then Cleveland will get two flagrant free throws. Since Mitchell was ejected, Coach Popovich selects the shooter from Cleveland's bench to shoot those free throws. Then it will be Cleveland ball on the side of free throw line extended with 24 on the shot clock. You got all that? So a flagrant two against... Collins, a technical foul against Mitchell, and Mitchell is gone. Since he's gone, Pop will select who shoots the free throw for Cleveland. And Collins is gone. The play for two. Cleveland will eventually get the basketball. Yeah, if you're in a tight game, you obviously look down the line and you pick the worst free throw shooter out there. 